Time now for another snapshot of the story of that lake, a 60s film held by the National Film and Sound Archives. It forms part of the Film Australia collection, which has recently come to Canberra. Here's the second and perhaps, perhaps the, most, the most exciting instalment. <laughs> Through the winter of 1964, the snow-capped adjacent ranges looked down on a further vigorous program of landscaping and planting. Additional roads were constructed to provide access and scenic motor drives around the 22 miles of shoreline. Trees from many countries will grace the foreshores of the lake. On the 28th of September 1964, Her Royal Highness Princess Marina, the Duchess of Kent, planted the first of some hundreds of English oaks, a gift from the United Kingdom. The formation of the lake has indeed strengthened the character of the city of Canberra as a national capital. Now spanning the waters of the lake are the two bridges, Commonwealth Avenue Bridge, the major of the two, and the King's Avenue Bridge. Passing beneath these, their size and design now became strikingly more impressive. Very dramatic. Another gripping instalment in the weeks to come.